Welcome combatants, we're going to talk about the ending of Sector as it teases once again Quan Chi but two things, Shinnok and also the fall of the Shao Rayu but do like, subscribe to the bell notification, follow this future for more content. So yes people, there's some interesting things here as we've got to talk about as we know now in Chaos Reign won't spoil too much about the ending but there is a certain interesting thing that does happen. Now in the ending of Sector's arcade ending you can see that she returns back to the Lin Kuei base we don't see Frost or anybody right now but we do know that she returns there and she's obviously missing Bihan, her man. But one interesting thing is she's approached by Quan Chi who asks her to go to the Temple of Elements. The Temple of Elements is the exact place where none other than the Amulet of Shinnok is resting and it's being hidden and being kept there hidden away and can't be captured. Liu Kang has it guarded by the elements. Now here's an interesting thing we know back in the day obviously it was Bihan who went there to the Temple of Elements to try and find it for not only Raiden but also Quan Chi who wanted him to go there and find it and bring it back to him and Raiden obviously knew what um, Bihan was going to do and that was mythologies with them going to bring back Shinnok who needed the amulet to return and said he'll be returning really soon but he was binding his time now the interesting thing is that Quan Chi has asked him for this um, amulet and asked him to bring it it to him now she doesn't obviously bring it to him because she finds Bihan in there but this is something that's really interesting indeed as it feels and seems like maybe just maybe it's possible that Shinnok is already someone who is like an ancient being maybe that's why Liu Kang said that Shinnok um, isn't there and that you know the amulet's as useless as its creator maybe that's because Shinnok is a being that was created by the amulet and has since since died or since been gone the reason why Quan Chi needs it is because something that's written about him in the Netherrealm, some wicked book or something that's there, has the keys and the purpose to resurrect him. Maybe he was a deity, a being back in the Great Kung Lao's era that was actually wicked, that was evil, something that had to be contained and be destroyed. Maybe he was still an elder god but became fallen yet again and Liu Kang this time around cast him down and then sent him all the way down to where he should be in the Netherrealm but on rising to the, falling to the Netherrealm, he since ceased exist and died and then became whatever he is now in there which is just the spiritual plane of wickedness now could it be possible that maybe Quan Chi is actually looking for him and looking to the keys to finding what Shinnok is finding the amulet maybe he's trapped inside the amulet and that's the reason why it doesn't work properly or that it's useless maybe Shinnok's not gone maybe Shinnok is someone who um, Liu Kang put in the amulet to remain maybe he no matter how much he tried to change him still became more evil and more stronger and more connected to the amulet which would mean Liu Kang had no other choice but to seal the amulet away and lock um, Shinnok inside of the amulet then having obviously Quan Chi being his loyalist to somehow find the scriptures the things that he left there upon his demise and his loyalist to write in the nether realm for him to be able to be resurrected once more and with Sector finding this area and then finding the amulet being there and Quan Chi asking him for asking her for it this is definitely something interesting to show that maybe just maybe Shinnok is on his way. Maybe just maybe Shinnok is actually the end game of the next game. Maybe he's going to be the character that we will see come into the next game and be someone who's diabolical and very strong. Like I said before, we know he's a cameo in this game and will probably be dropping in this year too or maybe even year three, we don't know. But for him to show up like this and for him to be a character that we have seen being teased and we've heard about him and what and heard them say Shinnok's amulet and then also being shocked at the usage of it means that there must be some form of power there must be some form of something that can be utilized because obviously General Shao used the amulet and maybe it just has to take a great deal of power to be able to use it maybe Shinnok's able to still use it from the inside to make it do what he wants to do who knows what could be up with the amulet but what we do know is that it is there and now that she's left and didn't bother to go inside to really claim it she did go inside but she didn't claim it that means Quan Chi now has freedom to be able to go inside the elements are defeated he can go past go get the amulet and do whatever it is that he wants to do and I think that's definitely something really interesting I'm excited and for all we know guys that could be our biggest hint yet to where Shinnok is maybe he is sealed inside the amulet maybe he's in there waiting to be freed and maybe that's exactly what Quan Chi wants to do but let me know what you think of this and do like subscribe this is your boy future boy and that's future stay frosty peeps peace